The first major protest along the Las Vegas Strip is underway right now for the first time in several years. It's happening outside the Cosmopolitan Hotel. Let's go to Action News reporter Jessica Janner now with uh, more on what's happening there. Jessica. Steve, the picketers are back after a few hours break, and you can see them across the street from where we're standing. They were out here at 11 this morning, and they plan to protest until 7 tonight. Organizers tell me they are 1,500 strong. We don't even have a contract. We're negotiating a contract. So we're just trying to get on par with everybody else up and down the strip. Just outside the popular casino, a show of solidarity Thursday by employees of the Cosmopolitan Hotel. We say no way. Workers belonging to the culinary union, people like bartenders, cocktail waitresses, and servers, are picketing, hoping the company serves up paperwork soon. So you guys haven't had a contract for 18 months? Very frustrating. It's been too long. In a statement, the casino says, quote, we understand it is the union's right to picket. The Cosmopolitan has been negotiating in good faith and will continue to do so. We want it, and uh, it's time that they stepped up to the table and, and we both agreed on a contract. Cosmopolitan says, take it away! We say no way! It's been over five years that a protest like this has happened, so visible right on the Las Vegas Strip. Many of the people in this line I spoke to have worked at the Cosmopolitan since it opened. For two years. I've been here since the day we opened, two years. Union members want a contract in order to receive health care, set wages, and overall job security. We want to stay here for years, and we want, we want those guarantees. I'm, I'm very happy that this many people showed up. And Metro has been out here all day. They've had officers on horseback, in patrol cars, and even undercover to make sure that things have run smoothly, and they have so far. Reporting live from Las Vegas Boulevard in Harmon, Jessica Janner, Channel 13 Action News. Jessica, thank you.